What's going on, everybody? I'm Justice. He's Joe. We're from UTC Under the Covers. Here to talk about a Christmas Day treat. That's the Monday night football game between the 11-3 and Baltimore Ravens and the 11-3 and San Francisco 49ers. Should be an absolute banger of a game. Um, something fun to wrap up your Christmas Day. But for that, well, let's try to make a little bit of extra money, you know, as Christmas Day is wrapping up. Before that, we have our lead handicapper, Joe. Joe, how are you looking at betting this Ravens 49ers game on, on Monday night? Yeah, well, what a great way to wrap up the week. Um, the Ravens traveling to the Niners. Uh, Niners are favored by five and a half in this one. Total of 46 and a half. Um, you know, uh, I've gotten in front of the Niners train at my own peril a couple of times this year. And, uh, I'm not going to do it again. Um, I think, you know, grabbing the Niners at home, anything less than a touchdown against any team in the NFL right now is probably good play. Um, 49ers at home are just blowing teams out. There's uh, one very notable exception. They got beat by the Bengals and Joe Burrow several weeks back. But outside of that, they've won every game at home, and uh, their wins are coming by an average of 18 points, including what I thought was um, – you know, one of the more incredible performances of the year when they just blew Dallas out of the water, 42 to 10 in San Francisco. Um, Brock Purdy at this point, you got to call him the odds on favorite to be the MVP. Uh, he runs an offense that's number one in yards per play, uh, number one in yards per completion and yards per attempt. So that just tells you when he drops back, they get it done. It's an efficient passing offense. And right now, you know, this is a team that over the years, it always seemed like one of the pieces was missing on this team. And when we've got a healthy Debo Samuel, a healthy George Kittle, and Brandon Ayuk. All those guys are full go. And when that team is fully healthy, they are just dangerous. They're tough to stop. Uh, the Ravens, for their part, man, this is an elite team as well. They are they're uh, tough defense, um, you know, tough against the run. They got a good pass defense, but I just think this is kind of a bad spot for them. They just uh, they just had a good win against the Jaguars on uh, Sunday night, but now they have to travel cross country to take on this Niners team, and um, and I think an injury that a lot of people just aren't really aware of that is very significant for this team was Keaton Mitchell going down to a, a season ending. ACL injury in that game, which is just tragic uh, for him and yeah. for the team. Um, it, it just sucks because that comes in the wake of losing Mark Andrews and J.K. Dobbins earlier this year. So this is a team that, you know, like we talked about the Niners' uh, skill positions being healthy. The Ravens' skill positions are not. And, um, you know, and I, you just can't expect uh, – you can't expect their quarterback, Lamar Jackson, to do everything as much as – a stud as he is and um this is a team in the ravens that wants to run the ball they're number one in the country in uh, in the nfl in rushing attempts but the niners tend to play with the lead and so they allow actually the fewest rushing attempts in the nfl themselves so i don't think the ravens will have the the luxury of sitting back and handing the ball off to gus edwards and whoever else might be running the ball with them at this point and um Okay. along with uh, Jackson himself. So I think Jackson's going to have to beat these guys with his arm, and I think that's tough to do. I think it's real hard to do that in San Francisco. So for all those reasons, um, we're going to take the, what I think, and I think you agree, we've talked about it online, offline, is the best team in the NFL. Um, yeah. Right now, if you made me bet them, I'm going to take the Niners to win the Super Bowl. Um, you're getting them at home. You're getting them under a touchdown. Um, let's sit back on uh, Christmas Day and uh, hopefully get a little gift from the 49ers here and let's lay the five and a half. And if you're looking for a place to bet this one or any other game, uh, we encourage you to go to betonline.ag. Use the promo code uh, UTCOVERS. They'll give you a 50% sign up bonus and, um, and let's win some Christmas loot on this one together. Yeah, love that. Love. Uh, what you also mentioned earlier was this is a Super Bowl preview. It may very well be. These are the two, um, arguably the two best teams in their conferences and their division. So I agree. I um, I love watching what this 49ers team does without the ball. You know, Trent Williams is a blocking machine, but oh. Brandon Ayuk and Debo Samuel, they block hangry. And Christian McCaffrey without the ball is like, it, it's amazing what they can do without the ball in this uh, Kyle Shanahan offense. So. Truly. 
I'm with you. Take them any in any game under a touchdown at this point. Um, yeah, take great pick. Take the 49ers minus the points at home on Christmas Day, and enjoy y'all's Christmas. And um, we'll see you guys next time. Have a good one.